Good afternoon, Bateman family. As we navigate this season we are in as a church, let's continue praying for Pastor Grady and his sweet wife Judy as they pursue what God has led them to do for us and with us here at Bateman Baptist Church. We are so grateful for the past several weeks of ministry and mission and the joy of serving alongside Pastor Grady for such a time as this. Anytime we go through change or experience a transition in life, our first question is always naturally, how is this going to affect me? Well, I wanna take a minute as we open the second town hall meeting to remind you of this. No matter what's happening around us, God is still on his throne and God's mission is still our mission. Jesus said, I will build my church and the gates of hell will not prevail against it. Our commitment is stronger than ever to love God, to equip the saints for the work of ministry and to take the gospel to our county, to our state, to our nation and to the nations across the globe. Bateman Baptist Church will always be passionate about having a dynamic kids ministry and student ministry, raising up the next generation of world changers. We will continue our passion for experiencing authentic community through our live Bible study for all ages and all life stages. Our hearts for Christ, exalting multi-generational worship, will continue to be exhibited in every venue on the Bateman campus. We will redouble our efforts in reaching the people in the shadow of our steeple because the Great Commission has no expiration date. As you know, our passion is to reflect heaven by reflecting our community and embracing our diversity. Of course, our commitment to preaching the Word of God will never waver. We affirm the Apostle Paul who said, I am not ashamed of the gospel of God unto salvation. We are so blessed to serve the living God who has been so faithful to this church for every single year of the 65 years of our existence. But you may be wondering, what's next for us? Well, as you know, we're now in the fifth week of our interim period which we anticipate lasting about six months. We don't want to rush this period. We want to allow plenty of time for our family to heal and to get our house back in order. But toward the end of this current interim period, however long that takes, the process of selecting a senior pastor will begin by forming a pastor search committee. During that time, you, the church body, will have an opportunity to vote on the people who will serve on our pastor search committee. And we will keep you up to speed every step of the way throughout the process. I firmly believe that Bateman Baptist Church's best days are ahead and we cannot wait to see what God has in store for us. As we continue to join him and his activity, I want to close with God's word from Hebrews chapter 10, verse 23. Let us hold unswervingly to the hope we profess, for he who promised is faithful. So now let's do what we do every Sunday here at Bateman. Let's open our hearts to hear from the Lord through Pastor Grady as he moderates our second town hall meeting. 